Hi, welcome to Board Game Cavern. My name is Brooks. Today we're going to be reviewing a great game called Onitama. Yo! Konnichiwa and welcome to Onitama. Onitama is a two-player game. You're playing as competing dojos, the red and the blue, and each side has the same pieces. You've got four disciples or acolytes. They are the students and you've got the master. One master who's basically the king in chess. Same on both sides. To win, two ways. You either take out the opposing master of the opposing color, or if you can get your master, if I was red, if I landed over here and got into the entrance of their dojo, I win. So it's a very quick game. It's like 10 minutes long, so you'll play it a few times in a row because it's really fun. And here's how it works. You got a deck of cards. This is the whole game, very simple. Deck of cards. Um, the way these work is these are positions of kung fu moves. And the black square is the square of the piece you want to move. And the colored squares are where they can possibly move this round. So you'll get two of these. We've got dragon and crab. Face them toward you. We've got boar on this side and crane. And then you pull one more card. And that card has a color in the corner. If it's red, red goes first. If it's blue, blue goes first. Red. So if it's red, we put it down here and we face it toward red because it's going to matter the directions, see? So the black square is any one of my pieces. But in this case, I have to play one of these two cards that I already have down here. So looks like the crab, I can go one up. I'm going to choose this piece to go one up. So one. Then the crab flips around so my opponent can use my move against me and I take Cobra for the next round. And it goes on like this. Now blue goes one of these two, crane or boar. Can't do much except go one forward, so I'm going to move the master one, give them boar, turn it around so they can see, so they can look at it the other direction, and cr crab comes into their lexicon. And it goes on like this. To take a piece, you simply land on the square and then that piece goes away and as I said you either have to take the opposing master or land on the opposing dojo's entrance front door uh, the cool part is as these cards flip around both sides can see what the potential is here for what could be done to them and it's the same cards uh, going all the way around in a, in a circle like yin yang Yo! Hey! Onitama excellent game Really easy, portable, great way to introduce children to the, the way chess is played in a very simple way without having to learn all those little pieces and such. I would say difficulty, a one out of five. This is really simple. You can learn it in five minutes. Playability, five out of five. This one is easy to play. I've had non-gamers play this, so it's a very good introductory to a game to get them into something simple that, you know, isn't Monopoly. And fun, four out of five for fun. It is fun. I break it out quite a bit, and it's always a hit. So, there you go. Onitama. Arigatou gozaimasu. Brooks, Board Game Cavern. Thanks for joining us. See you again.